Hi, my name's Rob and I'd like to introduce you to the Lensmaster RH1, a single arm gimbal known as a side mount, and the Lensmaster RH2, a double arm gimbal generally known as a full gimbal. Now each have the pros and cons. A single arm gimbal is obviously lighter, simply because there's less materials involved. A double arm, although it weighs heavier, it, they both do exactly the same thing. The only thing that does really need thinking about is a single arm does need a, a lens with a rotating collar. This is because otherwise you would be stuck in portrait mode. If you can't twist the lens round, then that's it, you're stuck in portrait, so you need a collar on your lens. So first you would mount your lens plate onto your lens. This is a big uh, lens plate, this particular 140mm, which comes with the uh, gimbals. You simply put it in position, tighten it down, and that's it, locked. To get the balance, you would slacken that off slightly and then pull forward or backwards until the lens is more or less just balanced. And then once it is, secure the clamp and that is it. On the full gimbal, you mount this way and tighten up. And once you get again get the balance of your lens, you just lock it in place and that is it. These lens plates have a locking mechanism which means the lens can't slide out. It's simply a couple of screws which are fixed in each end and they engage into the uh, clamp holder so that the other thing is you can't mount this way. You have to just slot it on that way. And it's just a safety feature to stop you from well, dropping the lens on the floor, which let's face it, nobody wants to do that. So there's the key differences between the two.